Hi, my name's Louis Barnett. I'm 23 years old. I'm a chocolatier and entrepreneur uh, in Kimber, which is South Staffordshire. So my story sort of began at the age of 11. I was uh, a bit of a miserable school student. I'd had lots of problems all the way through my education and I had a local tutor who had to help me with my handwriting. And after a couple of lessons, she told me that you know, she thought I had dyslexia. I obviously had no clue what that was and then was eventually professionally assessed with dyslexia, dyspraxia, dyscalculia, short term memory loss syndrome and a type of ADHD. And eventually my parents and my tutor and myself took the decision to leave uh, education, home education. So dyslexia, dyspraxia can manifest itself in lots of different areas. For me, it was most, mostly numeracy skills and it was written skills. So I was always very communicative verbally, but as soon as I had to turn that into something written, it, it all fell apart. My two great loves and passions in life was animals and food. So I started with falconry, uh, working with birds of prey in British conservation, but at the same time I'd always cooked and baked so uh, I, you know, at the time the big trend was chocolate. I'm sure if it had been cheesecakes, I'd be making cheesecakes today. Business can be as complicated or as simple as you want to make it. And for me, I didn't even know what the word entrepreneur meant until I was 14. But business, in its simplicity, is very easy. And to an extent, you know, the wonderful thing about being young is the naivety of just starting out somewhere. And I think that's the point. You've got to start somewhere. Don't expect that it's going to be this perfect, polished business plan and you're going to have the most fantastic website that looks as good as Coca-Cola's because guess what, they've paid hundreds and hundreds of thousands of pounds to do that. So start somewhere, keep it simple, be naive about it and most of all have fun. Because if you're not having fun and you're not passionate about it, what's the point?